174 is on the match. We're going to start this duel at 174. Chase Archangelo of Cleveland State in the green, Kent State in the red. Match is brought to you by Defense Up, Defense Up, the film which you built. McNally, qualifier last year at 184. Now 174. The duel starts up, at 174. McNally from Uniontown Lake down the road. He is a nasty cradler. Taking Archangelo, Chase Archangelo from Townsend, Delaware, Smyrna High School. There's a front headlock to take down McNally. He's on top. This is 174 pounds. McNally's going to have to return him. He does that. Archangelo shoots him off, and action is the call. Angelo does have a takedown out right away. Hard hands on McNally. McNally in the red, white singles for Kent, takes that left handed head inside, head outside shot. And we're going to get to see the swing matches. Swing matches to start 184 will be next. Nasser will take on Mass. There's a beautiful left-handed head outside shot. Cracks his hips down in the cracked out position. Could be looking for danger. Now he's got him in the old crowd ride there. Had the middle split. Archangelo battles forward. Down 4-1 now. You can see the time ticking down. 124 left in the first. And now this is where McNally wants to be. Has a cradle on top. Does some mean stuff in general. Probably a guy you're going to see at the NCAA tournament in Minneapolis. And this is his stuff right here. This is what he does. He hooks that foot. And now, oh, turns that foot out. Blocks the arm out of the way. And approaching a minute ride time, as you can see on the board over there. 47 seconds remains here in the first. Driver's seat for McNally on top. Kent State wanting a stall underneath on Archangelo, and there it is. And now he brings his hips up off the mat. And McNally, a state champion from down the road, and this is his bread and butter here. He's nasty on top. Crazy win in Vegas. One of the Bullard twins down by like 11 points, cradled and pinned him. We're inside of 10 seconds now, and it looks like we're going to go into the second 4 1. McNally, as I like to call him, McNasty. I gave him the nickname of Junior High. If he always sees the Division of State Champion Ohio, our Chandler's choice has got blood. We're going to get that cleaned up first. So, so our Chandler. Chase. Looks like it's going to be McNally going underneath. Our Chenjabo getting cleaned up over here. Kevin Taglianata, your head official, only official today. This is 174 pounds. McNally, depends what pole you look at. I've seen him as high as 18. I've seen him as low as like 22nd. So. A top 20 guy, kind of any way you put it. Kent State with two guys in the coaches panel rankings. So here we go, down underneath for McNally. He'll be underneath Archangelo will be on top. So Archangelo hovers. McNally looking to come up. By the way, Archangelo putting a little bit of a ride on him here. Nice chop, real nice chop. But up to his feet and out is McNally 5 1 lead here at 174. So if you're Kent State, you got to be thinking bonus points here. We got a four, essentially five point lead. He's got 132 a ride time as well. So Archangelo is going to have to make a fight out of this. McNally stalking him down. Archangelo has been dinged for stalling. Little half shot there by Archangelo. 115 remains here. 
in the second. McNally left-handed head inside single leg. Cracks a memory's head, looking to swim through. Maybe danger, the coaches, Kent State coaches are calling for danger. And pops his head, has both legs too. James Lowe turns down. McNally working on top of seven and one, gonna let him go. On the edge, Archangelo can't get pushed out here. That was a nice job. Right, Archangelo. McNally, 38 seconds left here in the second. Obviously trying to get his major decision on. Shot Archangelo, deep shot. Working on that foot is McNally, 25 seconds left here in the second. And now Archangelo's hands are locked. And now McNally's got him in a boatload of trouble here. 15 seconds remaining. Gentlemen, you aren't breaking that grip. He is not giving us up, and that's going to be a still only 10 seconds remains in the second period. 7-2 lead. Andrew McNally can stay. So it looks like we're going to go to the third period choice. Pachangelo. Guessing it'll be underneath. And let's see. He wants to go down. He's going underneath. I like his confidence. That's tough, man. That's a tough guy. Down 7 2. McNally, a shark on top, but Chenzelo does not seem phased by it, and I love it. And McNally cuts him loose. It's a shot from space, McNally. McNally, the Eastern Michigan transfer. So he transferred from Eastern Michigan after they dropped the program. He's from 20 minutes away. He's in on a deep shot, cuts across, double, hooks the down leg Turk. Could have Archangelo in some big trouble here. Archangelo bails out 9-3. It's going to be... And now he grabs a leg. Archangelo doing a nice job here. He's trying to score. Look at the cut across. He's got it. That's two. Hooks the foot. And this is going to get rid of that major decision that he was going to be working for. That's going to make it nine to five. How a lot of you like to work. And one ten remains. Chase Argentolo is trying to spoil any bonus points for, and he pulls him out of bounds. So McNally got to try and get out here. Argentolo putting a ride on him. He can actually ride for. 39, he can actually erase the ride time. It's effectively 10-5. So McNally moved, he could have called a caution on him, did not. So here we go. Our turn to work. Josh Moore check it, wants to check the score. Tag Lynn out, I gotta go check it. So actually, if it's 9-5, he gets one. It's effectively 10-5. They're saying that's the score. He's top. So we can get one. Effectively, it's 10-5 right now with that 139 ride time. So an escape and a takedown ride out is actually still a major. So Gengelo got to get a tough ride here. 55 seconds remains. McNally's head's on the mat. Now he's trying to knee slide up. Nice hip, nice, he's got a hip heist. He's up and out, it's 9-5, 10-5 now. A takedown right out for McNally as he's in on that deep shot. Two takedown, that makes it 12-5. He does have an eight point lead right now. So this is gonna be a major decision if he can hold him down. And, and Archangelo is fighting like no other to not give up this extra team point. 25 seconds remains and I've never seen a guy, I love the fight. He's trying to limp me out of it. And he's got to watch exposing himself to the cradle of McNally. And 15 seconds remains. If Archangelo can steal an escape here, it'd be huge. He's putting a hard right on 10 seconds remains here. And Andrew McNally is going to get that 13 to 5 major decision. And Kent State's going to be up 4 0 after 174. And a huge start for him. And the Golden Flash is going to be up on Cleveland State 4 0 as Andrew McNally gets a 13-5 major decision. And here comes the big one. 184 is the swing match. So Archangelo, great fight. McNally with the major. 